and peace to you from God the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Gnade und Friede sei euch von Gott dem Vater und dem Sohn und dem Heiligen Geist. We have come together to lay to rest the ashes of our sister Tante Deuch in Steinhagen. Let us go to its final resting place. Wohl auf, wohl an zum letzten Gang. Kurz ist der Weg, die Ruhe ist lang. Gott führt ein, Gott führt aus, wohl auf hinaus, kein Bleiben ist im Erdenhaus. As we proceed to the, the grave of your beloved father, the brass band will accompany us with music. Psalm 90 verse 1 to 2 says this, Lord, you have been our dwelling place throughout all generations. Before the mountains were born, or you brought forth the whole world. From everlasting to everlasting, you are God. Herr, du bist unsere Zuflucht für und für. Er, denn die Berge wurden und die Erde und die Welt geschaffen wurden. Bist du Gott von Ewigkeit zu Ewigkeit. Amen. God, the Lord over life and death, has already fetched Tante Dorchen. She is at rest in him. Let us now lay her ashes to rest in their final resting place, together with her beloved Vinci. I ask you to lay her ashes in the grave. Erde zu Erde, Asche zu Asche, Staub zum Staube. We commend her into God's hands. Wir befehlen sie in Gottes Hand. The grave will now be closed. After it is closed, I invite the family to lay your flowers and the wreaths on the grave. And we will sing together now, Gott ist die Liebe, while that happens.
Those from the family who would like to help are welcome to help. You are invited to lay the wreath and the flowers down. Angesichts des Todes bekennen wir unseren Glauben an den lebendigen Gott. In the presence of death we confess our faith in the presence of the living God. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, dead, and buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Christian Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, 
and the life everlasting. Amen. In John 11, Jesus says this, I am the resurrection and the life. The one who believes in me will live. And even though they die, and whoever believe, lives by believing in me will never die. Ich bin die Auferstehung und das Leben. Wer an mich glaubt, der wird leben, auch wenn er stirbt. Und wer da lebt und glaubt an mich, der wird nimmer mehr sterben. Lass uns nun gemeinsam auf Deutsch das Vater unser beten. Vater unser im Himmel, geheiligt werde dein Name, dein Reich komme, dein Wille geschehe, wie im Himmel so auf der Erde. Unser tägliches Brot gib uns heute und vergib uns unsere Schuld, wie auch wir vergeben unseren Schuldigen. Und führe uns nicht in Versuchung, sondern erlöse uns von dem Bösen. Denn dein ist das Reich und die Kraft und die Herrlichkeit in Ewigkeit. Amen. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ you conquered death and have called us to eternal life. Help us to follow your Son on the road that leads to life. In the Shafate, du hast durch Jesus Christus den Tod besiegt und uns berufen in dein ewiges Leib. Hilf uns, dass wir deinem Sohn nachfolgen auf dem Weg, der zum Leben führt. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. We sing Auf, Auf, mein Herz mit Freude. Before I speak the blessing, I'd like to make a few announcements. 
after the blessing and after the postlude, you are welcome to go to the hall there by the church. You saw the table on the veranda at the school. Refreshments are available. Tea, coffee, something to, to eat. But I also ask you to please allow the family to pay their last respects here and greet them or share your condolences with them at the hall. And now go with the blessing of the Lord. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make His face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord look on you with favor and give you peace. Der Herr segne dich und behüte dich. Der Herr lasse leuchten sein Angesicht über dir und sei dir gnädig. Der Herr erhebe sein Angesicht auf dich und schenke dir Frieden. Amen.